I'm Karen Johnson here at Rain Dance Canada for 2011. Tiff and Erica, an emerging, or well, I should say well known now at the Real World Film Festival, a filmmaker in your own right. Uh, yes, um, this year I'm one of uh, Real World's Emerging 20 for the class of 2011. So, um, you know, I'm an actor, but uh, to take power into my own hands instead of, you know, just waiting for my, you know, your cue? My cue to get auditions and stuff. I figured why not start writing my own roles for myself. So I'm in the process of writing my first, well, I'll say it's like a 30 minute um, comedy that I'm doing for myself. Oh, what caused this interest in filmmaking? Did something happen or have you always liked being behind the camera? Well, I, I think um, you, it's not enough just to be an actor today. You have to really diversify yourself in the industry. You have to understand the business. And uh, when I was working at Real World, Tanya was telling me it's not enough just to be an actor anymore. You have to be able to produce you have to be able to direct and so that you know inspired me to eventually start writing my um, very own I guess you could call it a 30-minute feature which is what I'm working on well Tony's a perfect example of diversifying yourself as I mean an actress and as well of course producing and coming up with the real world festival for filmmakers like yourself absolutely so I mean I got great uh, experience working there and being mentored underneath her as well so I just figured now is the time because I have some great ideas in my head like I have so many ideas it's just like getting them on on paper so I'm really excited about getting Tell this. Tell me more about your feature film. Okay well the feature film right now it's um, called uh, Keisha and Earl it's a romantic comedy so I would of course be playing the lead because I'm writing it and it's about a woman who works in a small town she uh, works in a diner she can't make ends meet so what she does is that she uh, takes out a loan from a loan shark she promises to pay it back she doesn't she skips town the day she's supposed to promise to pay it back on her way uh, to another town she meets up with a childhood friend Earl who's always had a crush on her loved her so those two start getting romantically involved little does she know that the lone shark is looking for her because he went by her diner looking for her she you know he has ways of just finding her and little does uh, Keisha know that the guy that she's dating is the lone shark's brother <laughs> <laughs> a little twist <laughs> yes I had to put I had to put a little twist in there somewhere because then it would just be a boring story. So I'm like somebody something has to collide, and I said the perfect thing is for Keisha to be dating the brother of the lone shark, and we all collide together. Yes. Now when are we gonna have our eyes on this production? That's a very good question. <laughs> uh, so well, I'm in the process of just getting uh, uh, my feet wet in writing it. Right. So I'm in the process. I I need a director. I need a producer. So I'm looking at maybe a launch date of 2013, hopefully, because it's gonna be an independent film and there's so much resources now such as rain dance to help me with my feature so I'm looking forward and partnering with them and you know getting the structure that I need to actually launch it and I wouldn't mind taking it to some festivals getting in some festivals so what are some of your tiff highs for 2011 well so far I mean I went to a great panel on the weekend with uh, how to get your uh, film documentary made Bill Duke who was also in get rich or die trying he was playing the godfather of 50 cent which I'm hoping will be my leading man I want him to play the leading man in my film so that was a high we went out to dinner we sat down and we talked and so I'm looking forward to uh, forward to the um, cocktail reception tomorrow night at the uh, uh, Empire Lounge for the uh, indie film lounge and then the following day we get our one-on-one -on -one with you know a producer or a director to pitch our project well best of luck to you thank you so much thank you. look out for Erica, a great filmmaker thank you, thank you. <laughs>